What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Beware Bassett, coming at you guys again with another one out here at Willamette Park, South Waterfront, Portland. About to get it in. Looking for a couple smallies today. We're gonna do a little smallmouth fishing out here on the river. A little windy, so bear with me, guys, with the wind and everything, which is good. Got out here early, so there's no boats. A little bit of chop on the water. But I still should be able to get on top water bite, I think. Gonna tie on a couple top water lures, get things going. We're gonna see you guys out here. Hope you guys enjoy this episode. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. For this is the guy we're gonna start out with. Walk him around a little bit. Let's start off over here. Rocks. Make my first cast out there. Should be a good morning for top water. It's a little bit of chop, but not too much. Good rocks over there. That big rock extends way out towards me. It's a little choppy out there. But it shouldn't be all that bad. I can hear that bait out there. Click, 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 click. <laughs> it's nice. getting that bait moving back and forth trying to see if we can get somebody to come pick her off I do got a tube tied on which will probably change to a curly tail grub we thank you No, these fish are here. That's for sure. It's just too good of a spot not to have fish here. Just a little choppy. Bummer. Oh, he missed it. Right there, he missed it. Come on back for it. I'm not doing right. I'm not fishing with a follow-up bait. Gotta pull my tube out and have it at the ready. So, little tip for everybody out there that doesn't do this. All right, so, like I said, a little tip for everybody out here that doesn't do this. I'm throwing this topwater bait 
And if I get a blow up and the fish doesn't come back, like, so I get a blow up. Oh, there was a blow up right there. Fish didn't come back. Now I can throw my tube over there, which. Got him. Oh, it came off. <laughs> Little guy. That was two blow ups, one cast. Good sign, good sign. Looking for a little bit bigger fish though. But per se right there, I got those two blow ups I didn't get. One of them didn't stick. I'm not sure if that's the same fish because it was a little bit farther in. I can always come back with my tube and chuck it over there. Problem is, we got this little bit of wind. I think my tube is a little too light, but let's still do the trick. Let's see if there's anybody down the bank line. A lot of good rock down here. Let's see what kind of adjustments we need to make with this wind. curly tail get a little bit farther of a cast but we can still go tube I guess which is maybe a better uh, I don't have any bigger tube heads so we might shove a jig head up in there Definitely makes it kind of hard when you're fishing something that's too light in the wind. And you have to really, I like to lay my line down on the water and almost drag that way. If I'm throwing something really light and my line gets caught in the wind, it doesn't just pull it along too much. And then I'll just do this, practically the same thing, but I'll do it sideways. Instead of popping up, I'll pop sideways. It makes the bait move closer to me, but I still get that crawfish-esque reaction. But we're definitely gonna need something heavier. Curly tail grub. Go time on real quick. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah. No, I don't want to waste what's left. All right, back to the curly tail grub.
my guy ripped off the rest of my tail. Guess they like this color. So here there's some big rocks out by that house. And under those houses, it goes quickly, very quickly, from about seven feet to 22, 25, somewhere around there. Came back for it down that time. He was a dink. Oh, he got off. Came back for it again. Oh, <laughs> he got off. Oh, oh. Ripped my tail off. That was an absolute dink. I'm gonna throw it without the tail on it. Let's see if I can get him to come back. <laughs> I was like, what is that? It was even a funky hook set because I didn't know what that was. Dinkers. This is what we've been dealing with on the lower Willamette all year long. Like I said, it's still a blast to catch them. If I really wanted to catch bigger fish, I should probably size up, but. Eh. I'm okay with it. I'm having fun. There's one. Oh, there he goes. Do a little top water action. Bigger bait, maybe a bigger fish. Good glide right here with less waves, less wind. Really getting that bait to move side to side. Oh, ho, 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 did you see that? He went for the kill shot. <laughs> Wicked. Wicked, wicked. 
That was way cool. Alright, last cast, y'all. It's all she wrote. It's all she wrote.